So we got 10 to 15 minutes down the road. Uh, we are now stuck in pitch dark. Because I'm a daily vlogger! Benjamin. 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 Benjamin, it's time to eat. Breakfast. Benjamin. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Benjamin. Benjamin, Dorothy wants to eat with you. Dorothy. Dorothy, where's Benjamin at? Dorothy. A giant scoop of corn. Ooh, that looks so good. Maybe a little extra. Ooh. Love it. Scoop and a half. What else? One scoop of black Ooh, sunflower black seeds. Black sunflower seeds. Looks delicious. Look at that. That's a good meal. Oh, two scoops of wheat formula green. Jeez, sweet babe. because I don't know, but they're sweet. A really good uh, breakfast. Look at that. Oh, that looks so healthy and colorful. Chef Dob. Yes. Following you. Oh. Dorothy, come in. Come on in, Dorothy. Wait, I hear Benjamin. There he is. There he is. Benjamin. Benjamin. Benjamin we're, up here. we're up here, bud. Come on, my little friend. Yeah, Benjamin. Good morning, buddy. Yeah, Benjamin. Good morning, bud. How are you? You're really fast, Benjamin. better today. I uh, <clears throat> fell apart a little yesterday, but I handled my demons a little bit this morning. I took my time. I decided it was time for me to drive the Unimog. You know, humble me a little bit. And uh, I'm headed in for flight lessons. There is a possibility that they might get canceled. Um, it's very, very overcast, but I guess we'll find out and see. You should be texting me here soon. Um, so I've read the comments about yesterday, and a lot of people give me advice on... I'm just going to run the stop sign. Fuck it. A lot of people give me advice on how I should handle my head and my workload and things like that. And something that I've always had inside of me is the second that I get things under control, I add more things to my plate. So... That's just something that I've consistently done my whole entire life. I like, I'm naturally driven to being overwhelmed. I don't necessarily like it. So what I need to do, I think, is try to figure out how to operate all these things and try to overwhelm my things, overwhelm myself, or keep myself busy with things that make me happy. Um, you know, things with Dana that keep me happy, that, that might be different than work, that sort of distract me a little bit more, you know what I mean? Uh, so, so um, that's my goal today, is be in and out of meetings. I need to delegate, but the problem is, what, what we sort of have going on is very, very complex. We don't have to make it seem like my businesses are a lot different than everyone else's, but... There's a, lot to, there's a lot of different facets, and it's not just as easy as advertising on Facebook. I know a lot of other guys that brands, and they just, they just advertise on Facebook and push the product. And the dilemma that I have is I have to run all these companies, and I have to keep them going, and you know, obviously they have to succeed because that's in my nature, but I can't just take the easy way out, I think, like, a, like other brands. 
little backfire. I'm not sure what it's all about. But there's been some other brands out there and they just, they push shit, they sell shit. And it all comes back to like, my face being on it, Dana's face being on it, and us having to deal with the repercussions of if we sell shit. In addition to that, we started ourselves out as a very, very small brand where we engage with social like crazy. Now, as we grow, we need to continue to engage with all platforms of social like we used to, as much as we can. That's you know, part of the reason I make these videos. Um, that's part of the reason we have such a good customer service team. But, you know, when it, when it's, it's not really scalable, unfortunately. Like, we get to a certain size and it just doesn't work anymore. And that's what I was battling with yesterday. In addition to that, I just made some mistakes. I, I got involved with some people. Um, I've done it before. I'm, I'm sure I'll do it again, but I like to trust the best in people and I like to, I'm just rambling right now. I'm just rambling. I just need to embrace driving Unimog and like it. Uh, I'll get back to you guys later. I'm just gonna enjoy what I'm doing right now. Well, here we are doing the, the voiceover. This is the, the voiceover to the weekly Warhouse Gym video. Weekly Warhouse Gym video YouTube voiceover. Backslash Warhouse Gym. Whoa, are you lifting in khakis right now? Khaki joggers. Why they are you like wearing khaki joggers? That was That's not a workout outfit. I went right from work. I have clothes with me. Why don't you just be prepared, You're gonna bro. overlay this clip? No, I'm not gonna overlay this clip. Guess how much I'm benching Get, in this yeah, clip. Yeah, look. Why my screen looks so fucking dirty? You're benching 135, bro. It's not 135. It's that's, 225. That's two plates. No, two those tens. plates don't count. Only 45s count. Two and a half. Only 45s two count. Seven. So we got the Unimog in here. Uh, we just took these upper supports out. If everybody wants a GT3 rear bumper, we have one. Um, we also took that out so I can start seeing out the back window. Um, a few things we want to do. We have to relocate those lights. I think we're going to mount the spare there. We're going to go bigger. On the tires. We need to get tools in here. All right. Gas can. Oh, so we have we have we have a gas can here. Is there gas in it? Uh, I don't. I doubt it. And this is empty. That's empty. Oh, it's storage. There's maybe. Hopefully, there's gas in those. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We'll know It'll last soon. longer than 13 minutes. <laughs> Made an effort to stay out of some meetings. Um, I still was in some very annoying, annoying, annoying meetings uh, with some lawyers and shit like that. Um, and I think the problem is I don't give you guys full biz of visibility to like what's going on. So a lot of you guys that are commenting, um, hey, you should delegate this, or you should do this. There's actually some things that I specifically have to work through that I'm not gonna fully tell you um, for multiple reasons. But now we are on our way to uh, a shop to have them look at the Unimog to see they specialize in off-road um, and see what they think. See what they think they can do. See what we think we can sort of get out of it. So, and then I'm gonna lift some weights. Well, we didn't make it. No, we didn't make it. Not really surprised. <laughs> we, uh, how long did we even drive for? Uh, 10, 15 minutes. So we got 10 to 15 minutes down the road. Uh, we are now stuck in pitch dark. It does have that. I don't even know if that shows up, but we're we're stuck in the. Uh, I don't know. We're stuck. It's pretty though. It's yeah. It's nice. Everyone's holidays lights look really nice. Just taking the views. Rob's yeah. taking me out for a date. Yeah, it's just date night. I got Mike here. <laughs> we'll make a move on him soon. Uh, so I think the plan is to bail on us trying to go anywhere. How you doing? Um, and. Ideally, just make it back to the warehouse. Hopefully. Yeah, we're doing really good. All right, so we got a screwdriver though, don't we? Yep. And a lug wrench. Perfect. Doesn't help us. We got a, a hijack. Oh, it's true. We got an extra tire. Uh, we have two full tanks of gasoline, although the um, truck doesn't know what to do with the gasoline. <laughs> All right, we made it back. 
because we're goddamn champions. But. It's that weird sound. It, that's the sound it sort of made before. That like pop, 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 pop. Fitting fell off. Which fitting? Oh, wow, yeah. It's pumping air out. Fitting fell off. My carb is fucking shit. So it's kicking air out of there? It's uh, a little compressor. Belt driven compressor. And it's air out. Updates. Things have escalated. Uh, I removed the seats. Um, I found a secret compartment. I was hoping there'd be German documents in here from the war, but there wasn't. Oof. We found out multiple things here. One, uh, intake came off. Two, uh, I was wondering why I had no brakes. The air compressor um, came unbolted here and then was loose down there. So there's two issues that there apparently was, which there's a tank under here mounted. Uh, that's, uh, that's the air tank. So seats came out. I don't know, I think it's time to like clean the inside and like paint and some stuff, Mike. I agree. I think that's what this is meant for. So, Unimog is gonna be on this lift for a little while. And it only makes sense that it's next to the death cart. Unimog death cart. They're like brother and brother. Your it's, Unimog's like its weird uncle. Yeah, it's like a weird uncle Unimog with its one red tire. <laughs> I just got down a really good training session. A really, really good training session. Um, last night I went to the Warhouse gym and I was very distracted. Tonight I trained here and I felt really fucking good. I'm gonna write myself a training program tonight because I need something to follow. I need something to keep me on task. I saw a lot of people sort of speak up about my New Year's thing yesterday and they said, oh, you know, blah, blah, blah. And, um, I've even seen people post stuff about like, why would you wait till New Year's? Why would you, why would you do this? Why would you do that? Like, no, start now. You know, you're wasting blah, blah, blah days by waiting till the first. You know, I don't know. Sometimes people need, you know, just like you need goals. Sometimes you need a goal start date. I don't think you should hate on anyone else's process. Um, I'm going to start. Give myself a few days to get my shit together, casually start moving that direction, and then set myself a cutoff date. That's what I'm gonna do. Maybe I'll share it with you guys. Maybe we'll do an REL trainer for me, specifically. I'll share it with you guys, maybe we can do it together. But in the meantime, I'm gonna start this motherfucker, and I'm gonna drive it home, going 150. It's gonna be a good night. Vlogger. Daniel's making me a black bean burger. Cause I got sabotaged. I heard that, uh, I heard that the floor is down upstairs. Well, most of it. Most of it. I'm going up. Kaya, I'm going up to look at the floor. You're not allowed to come. You gonna turn the lights on for me?
That's really cool. Jeez, man. That's gonna look really cool. You're quite the little designer, bubs. Try.